Hi, I'm Yukari Max, a Japanese mom with two kids living in Kyoto. Today, I'm excited to share a Japanese healthy meal prep for late spring. It's not only nutritious, but also filled with a variety of vegetables. When we're tired and can't cook, we often go for snacks like sweets. But with meal prepping, we've got healthier options at hand. Let's dive in and see how much fun and how helpful meal prepping can be, even when life gets hectic. Sashimi is delicious on its own, but sandwiching it between layers of kelp enhances its flavor even more and prolongs its freshness, so I really like to make this. All you have to do is cut the cap to the size of the fish, sandwich it between the slices, and leave it in the fridge for 20 hours or more. If you sprinkle a little bit of salt, it's even better. The next day, after letting it sit for one day, the moisture had been removed and the flesh had firmed up, becoming moist and sticky. It was really delicious. I'm going to make my usual quick pickles, but this time I bought a different brand's pickle base. It has used juice in it. What I'm peeling is Chinese yam, which can make your mouth itchy, but it's yummy. Chinese yam is rich in minerals like potassium and magnesium. This helps maintain the body hydration balance and replenish minerals lost during the summer heat. So it's refreshing and delicious, especially in hot weather. The nearby green grocer sells a variety of vegetables grown in Kyoto, most of which are harvested in the morning, so they're exceptionally fresh and delicious. That's why I often prefer simple seasonings. Preparing the vegetables by washing and cutting them allows for various culinary creations and simplicity is truly the best. I'm making pickles with seasonal vegetables. The ones I made earlier were Japanese pickles, called asazuke, which don't have vinegar, so they're not sour. These ones are regular pickles, so they have acidity, perfect for hot days. I got fresh garlic from Kyoto, so I'm gonna chop it up and add it directly.
The Easy Vinegar I'm using is a Japanese brand that contains pure rice vinegar, sugar, salt, and kombu dashi. So just by adding it, you can instantly achieve a Japanese style vinegar flavor. My son loves stew, so making stew every week is a must. It can be frozen too. I'm happy because he'll eat vegetables that I secretly put in. I usually put about twice the amount of meat stated on the box. Following the recommended amount somehow feels like it's not enough. Since there's lemon in it, it tastes delicious without adding extra salt. My kids love namel, especially bean sprout namel. They'll devour a whole bunch in no time. Since I got fresh spinach, I made spinach and bean sprout namel. The key to making it better is to mix it well by hand to blend the flavors nicely. I had an extra piece of chicken so I'm marinating it with lemon and salted rice malt before freezing it as is. Salted rice malt is a traditional Japanese ingredient made from a fermented mixture of water, salt and koji. Koji is malted rice or beans covered with koji malt, which is used in many Japanese dishes for its unique flavor and fermentation properties.
In Japan, this liquid salt koji is quite popular and I use it often myself. Carrots are packed with better carotene, a potent antioxidant known for its anti-aging benefits. Better carotene supports healthy skin and mucous membranes, making it ideal for protecting against sun damage. Whether sliced in sandwiches or served as a side dish, carrots are incredibly versatile. I tried making a completely original soup using leftovers from the fridge. Scallions are in season now, so I promptly bought some when I saw them at the store. These are pickled in vinegar. I have a bottle of pickled scallions, so I just adding them makes it easy to create Japanese style pickles. After thoroughly drowning excess moisture and storing properly, they can be preserved for a long time. Add chili peppers to spice up the taste and keep insects away. How did my meal prep go this week? It's springtime in Kyoto, but it's getting hotter, almost like summer. That's why I might have prepared more pickled and refreshing dishes. I hope this video is helpful for someone. Thank you for watching.